Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So we're going to be doing a bedroom makeover. So I've been in this place for over a year now and you know, things are starting to come together. The living room has seen some progress as you would have seen in the previous vlogs. But now the bedroom is what we're gonna change now. So let's just take a look at the before and we can show you kind of what we've been working with. As you can see, no bed frame. Now this has caused a lot of issues just because we don't have a lot of storage. So that's why there's clothes over here and piled up. Well, there was a box there, but now they kind of just got all messy and stuff like that. This is new. Uh, we painted this, check out Emily's short. That was a fun night, but we revamped the laundry basket so far and able to display some nice things. Obviously the room is a bit of a mess right now, but when we get the bed installed, everything will be more tidy. And then you would have saw the closet already, but there is a lot more drip coming in after the New York trip. What we're gonna do is take some of these clothes, the t-shirts and stuff like that, and put it into our bed frame because we got a storage bed with drawers. So that way we can clear the closet a bit, also clear that pile there. We're gonna be getting rid of that bedside table and then we'll be able to tidy up all of this. So the first step of what we're gonna be doing is taking the bed out, taking all the furniture out and getting a good vacuum in there. We haven't actually ran the vacuum in this bedroom yet. Okay, well, I don't know if you can see how dusty this room is, but everything's taken out right now. So that's a good indication right down there. I was too lazy to remap this thing, so it's kind of going off an incorrect mapping, so we'll see if this room gets vacuumed accordingly. Because it's supposed to start off with the base station, but obviously I just picked it up and placed it. So we'll see how this goes. But overall, this vacuum does pretty well. I've been happy with the performance of it. The only thing is though, that this is my third one actually, and there's just battery issues if you don't use it for a while like I think maybe a couple months at a time, then it just doesn't charge. I think that's just a defect of the thing because for it to work or for it to charge, it needs a network connection. But obviously if it dies, then there's no network connection. I don't know if that made sense. But anyways, if it dies, it just won't charge because it won't get connected to the base station. And so uh, this is my third one because the first time I didn't open it up when I first bought it because I was waiting to be moving into this place. The second time, obviously, I didn't use it because my place is going through renovations. So here we are, the third one. Third time's a charm, but we're gonna be keeping this thing going all the time, so hopefully we don't have any problems. Okay, so it actually didn't work with the mapping, so I just brought this thing in here so we could just do the remapping process. Then once this is clean and thorough, we can do set up the bedroom and then I'll remap the whole place again, putting this back in the living room. But just temporarily, just because we want a thorough cleaning of this, just want to make sure that this is all set up correctly and this everything is all covered. Small inconvenience, but at least we can get the vacuuming and mopping all done in this bedroom. Right, floor is vacuum and mopped, but it looks like a mist spot over here. Gotta do some old fashioned oh, dusting. Okay. Uh, so I come back and most of it's, well, some no. of it. You gotta drill it now. All right, got the headboard started. Look at this though. Made in Italy. Fancy imported bed. Right, here's the progress. Now we have a freestanding bed. Oh my god, we were so close. But I just realized that I put the top level for this one because I want it on the third level. But then for the slants, I put it on the bottom. They have to go up top, so I have to redo both sides. Guys, so we built the bed and now emptying the closet, cleaning it up now and putting it into different drawers. Okay guys, so here is the finished product, or at least so far. Made a few changes, so the laundry thing now moved over here. Still have to figure out what to do with these guitars. Closet looking a lot more clean because we were able to fit everything down there. Give you a quick tour of that. Might be making a hat video soon, but also do peep these shoes right here, the shoe of the summer. My beautiful girlfriend got me those ones. Can't wait to wear those ones, see the fits. It's gonna be 
fire. Anyways though, furnishing this bedroom was long overdue, but I'm glad finally got everything together, and I'm happy how everything turned out. It's a lot more organized and less clutter. I like how we're able to display some nice things. You know, the sunglasses and the perfume, and there'll be a lot more YouTube videos coming up soon. I know I've been slacking on you guys, but don't worry, the grind won't stop. Also too, I've been working something on the side, and I start my own business, so maybe take you along for that as well too. Follow along and watch me go from rags to riches, or maybe from Yale Town to uh, Cardboard Box because my business goes bankrupt. I don't know. But anyways, you'll find out in this journey. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. I'm a rock star.